Welcome back. Well, a Wild Horse and Burrow adoption event is in Palestine, Texas for the next two days. The Bureau of Land Management officials say the event is a way to help manage their population. KTRE's Vanessa Johnson brings us more. The Wild Horse and Burrow adoption event has made its way to East Texas, bringing a total of 120 horses and burrows. The mix consists of mares, gildings, yearling horses, and burrows. These wild horses and burrows come from our public lands in the 10 western states, our Bureau of Land Management public lands. The Bureau of Land Management has multiple adoption events throughout the year as a way to manage the population. Cowan says there isn't enough natural resources for the number of animals. There's just too many of them for the land to support. Most of our wild horses are from Nevada. There's a severe lack of forage and water and rainfall. Uh, so if we left them unmanaged, they would double in herd numbers every four years and triple every six years and just tear up the terrain, the range, and run out of forage and water. Cowan says any horses and burros that are left after the adoption event will go to their off-range corral in Pauls Valley, Oklahoma. And for any animals who are not adopted by age seven, they will go to ranchers who are contracted with the organization for a permanent home. Cowan says it is a costly operation. Whenever they go to off-range pastures, whenever they've been offered to the public several times for adoption, and then they go to off-range pastures, the ranchers are paid per head per day and the horses just live. So um, it does eat up some of our budget. The adoption event is only for tomorrow and Saturday. The price to adopt is $125. Vanessa Johnson, KTRE, East Texas News 9. For more information on this adoption event, you can visit KTRE.com and look for more information in the big red box section or to make it easier, just scan the QR code you see right here on your screen.